Sukar Barrage The Sukar Barrage is a barrage across the Indus River near the city of Sukar, Pakistan. It was built during the British Raj from 1923 to 1932 as the Lloyd Barrage to help alleviate famines caused by lack of rain. The barrage enables water to flow through what was originally a 6166 million acres, 20,000 square kilometers, of irrigated land. The retaining wall has 66 spans, each 60 feet wide, each span has a gate which weighs 50 tons. Tarbala Dam Tarbala Dam, or the National Dam, the world's largest earth-filled dam on one of the world's most important rivers, the Indus, is 103 km from Rawalpindi near Haripur district. It is a major source of Pakistan's total hydroelectric capacity. Tarbala Dam is part of the Indus Basin Project, which resulted from a water treaty signed in 1960 between India and Pakistan guaranteeing Pakistan water supplies independent of upstream control by India. Construction began in 1968, and was completed in 1976 at a cost of Rs.18.5 billion. Over 15,000 Pakistani and 800 foreign workers and engineers worked during its construction. It is the biggest tidal power station in Pakistan having a capacity of generating 3,478 MW of electricity. The dam has a volume of 138,600,000 cubic yards, 106 million cubic meters. With a reservoir capacity of 11,098,000 acre feet, 13.69 km superscript 3. The dam is 469 feet, 143 m, high and 8,997 feet, 2,743 m, wide at its crest while total area of the lake is 260 sq. km. It helps to maintain the flow of the Indus during seasonal fluctuations. A new, smaller hydroelectric Required for foreign visitors. Diamar Basha Dam Diamar Basha Dam is the name of a dam that has been planned in the northern areas of Pakistan on the river industry. It is located about 314 km upstream of Tarbala Dam and about 165 km downstream of Gilgit. The dam is expected to create a large reservoir with a gross capacity of 7.3 million acre feet, 9 cubic kilometers submerging large tracts of land in the Diamar district. The dam is supposed to have a power generation capacity of 3.360 MW and is expected to considerably ease up the skewed hydro to thermal power generation ratio in Pakistan. It is expected that the detailed drawings of the dam would be completed by March 2008, immediately after which construction work shall begin. Tanda Dam, Ramsar Site Tanda Dam is located in Kohat District, Northwest Frontier Province, Pakistan. The site comprises a small water storage area in semi-arid hills in the catchments of the Kohat Toy River. Although most of the shoreline is steep, stony, and devoid of aquatic vegetation, at the west end there are some areas of gently shelving muddy shores with a small amount of emergent vegetation. Namal Dam Namal Lake is located in one corner of the Namal Valley in Mianwali, Punjab, Pakistan. This lake was created when Namal Dam was constructed in 1913. Namal Dam is situated some 32 km from Mianwali city. Namal Lake spread over 5.5 square kilometers in Namal Valley. There are mountains on its western and southern sides. On the other two sides are agricultural areas. Namal Dam is situated some 32 km from Mianwali city. This dam is very old. British government constructed it.
When Mianwali became district then the district government buildings were constructed using water stored in Namal Lake from this Namal Dam. In 1913, British engineers, to meet the scarcity of irrigation and drinking water, built a dam on construction of Thal Canal and installation of tube wells, its utility of water squeezed up to some limit. The gates of the dam are repaired by the irrigation department regularly but without enthusiasm. The hill torrents and rains fill the Namal Lake round the year. Due to a drought-like situation in the country, this lake dried up last year, which is the first incident of its kind during the last 100 years, said one of the senior inhabitants of this area. An engineer told this correspondent that the name of Namal Dam still exists on the list of dams in the world. Namal Lake is an ideal abode for the migratory birds in winter season when thousands of waterfowls, including Russian ducks and Siberian cranes, land in the lake water. Due to the apathy of the wildlife department, these guest birds are ruthlessly killed by poachers. To save these birds, the Wildlife Department must declare this lake a sanctuary. There is beautiful sulfur water fountain near the Numal Dam site. People use this water for treatment of different diseases. This sulfur water fountain is very old, but even then, the flow rate of water is same. If government take care and give attention to this fountain, then this can be a great source of sulfur. By drying the water, you can get a good quality sulfur from here. Kanpur Dam Kanpur Dam is a dam located on the Harrow River near the town of Kanpur, about 25 miles from Islamabad, Pakistan. It forms Kanpur Lake, a reservoir which supplies drinking water to Islamabad and Rawalpindi and irrigation water to many of the agricultural and industrial areas surrounding the cities. The dam was named from the former Kanpur village which was submerged by the reservoir, so a new Kanpur town has been built downstream of the dam. The dam was completed in 1983 after a 15-year construction period believed to have cost Rs 1,352 million. It is 167 feet high and stores 110,000 acre feet of water. Misriat Dam Misriat Dam is located 12 kilometers southwest of Rawalpindi. This small dam has an artificial lake with boating and fishing facilities. Fishing permit may be obtained from fishing guard at Misriat. It Tanaza Dam It is a small dam located at about 35 kilometers southwest of Rawalpindi on Damiel Road. Ideal for a day trip. The lake has a quiet atmosphere. Warsak Dam The Gignatic Multi Purpose Warsak Dam is situated 30 kms northwest of Peshawar in the heart of tribal territory. It has a total generating capacity of 240,000 kilowatts and will eventually serve to irrigate 110,000 acres of land. Tonsa Barrage Tonsa Barrage is located on Indus River in Punjab, Pakistan. The Tonsa Barrage was completed in 1958, and it has been identified as the barrage with the highest priority for rehabilitation. It requires urgent measures to avoid severe economic and social impacts on the lives of millions of poor farmers through interruption of irrigation on 2 million acres, 8,000 square kilometers, and drinking water in the rural areas of southern Punjab, benefiting several million farmers. In 2003, the World Bank has approved a $123 million loan to Pakistan to rehabilitate the Tonsa Barrage on the River Indus whose structure had been damaged owing to soil erosions and oldage. This project will ensure irrigation of the cultivated lands in the Water birds, notably anatidae, and a breeding area for several species, notably Dendrocygna java and ICA, and a staging area for certain cranes, grus grus and anthropoids virgo, and shorebirds.
Dendrosigna java nica is a common breeding summer visitor with 325 counted in August 1995. Over 24,000 waterbirds were present in mid-January 1987, including, 620 Phylacrocorax niger, 79 Anser indicus, 2,780 Anas penelope, 770 A strepera, 4,880 A cricaw, 270 A platyrinchos, 1,660 A acutta, 390 A clipiata, 4,690 Ithia farina, 53 Anthropoids virgo, 150 Porphyrio porphyrio and 7,510 Fulica atra, along with fewer numbers of Tachybaptis ruficulus, Taterna taterna, Marmarinetta angustirostris, Netta rufina, Ithia fulagula, Hydrophagianus chirurgus, Hemantopus hemantopus and Numnius arcata. The wetland was first declared as a wildlife sanctuary of 6,567 HA in 1972, the sanctuary was relisted in April 1983, then in July 1988 and subsequently in March 1993. It has been proposed that the Indus River from Tonsa Barrage upstream to Kalabah and downstream to Gudu Barrage be declared as a World Heritage Site for the Indus Dolphin Plot Minor.